Hey everyone, and welcome to part 6 of my GT Online How to Counter series. In this part, we're going to go over the best counters to jets, more specifically the Hydra and the Laser. However, most of the tricks that I show you in this video will work for any jet that you may encounter. Now, of course, there may be many counters that work for you that I don't talk about in this video. I'm just going over the ones that are the easiest to pull off and use. The first and most obvious one is the explosive sniper rifle. This thing will take out hydras and lasers in just two shots, and the more armored planes like the pyro and the starling in just three shots. Jets that come after an explosive sniper user will not be flying very much longer. If you're trying to sell cargo in public lobbies, I highly recommend putting these on just in case things go wrong. But let's say you can't afford explosive rounds or don't have them unlocked. Well, you might have FMJ rounds unlocked. Put some of these on and you will destroy jets pretty fast as well. My only issue with FMJ rounds is that they are extremely inconsistent. Sometimes you can destroy a jet in like 8 rounds and sometimes it takes like 15. It's just really inconsistent. Obviously, it's not as effective as explosive rounds. However, they are a much cheaper option and you can hold a lot more of them. If you have a squad, you can coordinate your loadouts too. Say you get 3 people with FMJ rounds on their sniper and then you all shoot at the same jet. It will go down pretty quick. But let's say you don't even have a bunker unlocked to research anything. You just have a regular heavy sniper. Well, start up a CEO and spawn in some BST and snipe the jet. It takes quite a lot of rounds to blow up a jet with this method, as you can see in this clip. However, you will definitely make their jet smoke after a few shots, and that can deter them away. I don't usually condone the use of BST, but if you don't have any other options and find yourself up against the jet, this method can work out pretty well. So in terms of using vehicles to counter jets, you can go dogfight them in the Sea Breeze, Starling, or Pyro, and you will win 90% of the time when going up against a Laser or Hydra in free mode. You just have to somewhat know how to fly a jet, and unless you come across someone who is like a god in the laser or a hydra, you'll be able to take them out with ease, because of the insane turning radius that the starling and the pyro have. If you're looking for a defensive vehicle to tank some jet strafes, call in an MOC and drive the cab around the city, it will take them a while to take you out. Bring a revolver with FMJ rounds also, and keep tapping them with shots as they come down for the strafes and you'll damage their jet enough to disable it after a few times. Chances are this will take a while because of the optimal range of the revolver, but it can still work out for you in the end. And last, but certainly not least, we have my favorite strategy against jets, the Avenger. So if you guys didn't know, the Avenger's top turret is the only thing in the game that can aim straight up into the air, which is perfect for the people like to try to dive bomb you. So what I do is call in the Avenger, and then get in the back and use it as like an armored anti-aircraft gun. The turret's rate of fire is insanely fast, so you can put some serious pressure on jets to try to come after you. And this is even more effective if you put it into the air in autopilot, because you won't take splash damage from the jet's explosive cannons hitting the ground. And since it's armored, a lot of the time the jets will crash into the Avenger while trying to shoot it, as you can see in the clip I'm showing. This strategy is very underrated and extremely satisfying when you get it to work. One thing I forgot to mention is that the range on the Avenger turrets are insane as well. At longer ranges, all you need to do is lead the target and follow the jet's path, and eventually you'll hit it. Anyways, those are my most effective counters for jets in GTA Online. If you guys enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, as well as subscribe to my channel for more guide and PvP related content. If you have a favorite counter for jets that I didn't mention in this video, comment it down below. And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.